fuchsia is based on gn metabolic system gn metabolic system comes from chrome os gn is metabolic system because its scope is only to take dot gn build scripts and translate those into dot ninja build scripts that's it so once dot ninja build scripts are generated next responsibility goes to ninja ninja build system ninja build system takes this uh, dot ninja build scripts as input and uh, gen does actual source code compilation means it takes c or c++ or rust implementation and generates a uh, corresponding binary or um, you can say executable or library whatever so that that's whole responsibility goes to ninja so in in this uh, if you see a stack of build system then gn comes on the top at the top and then below that comes uh, ninja and then there on ninja based on the configuration ninja either use g++ or gcc or whichever uh, uh, compiler actual compiler to do the uh, source code compilation so in in this whole stack we have two parts gn as a metabolic system and counterpart is or uh, ninja build system so how does it work let's check it out so first of all we will clone gl gn uh, build system source code so we have cloned here so we have cloned source code of gn and even in fuchsia same thing happens uh, when we uh, get fuchsia complete source code we get this uh, gn uh, meta build system source code but to work to, but to let gn uh, work on gn meta build scripts it has to be executable right so Uh, so here gn is also based on ninja build system okay that's why uh, here we are using uh, ninja hyphen c out to generate uh, the binaries so here uh, we are using python script first of all to to uh, generate dot in ninja and then we are using ninja build system to compile and uh, uh, generate build system so here we are not compile where we are not actually doing source code compilation we are compiling the build system itself the whatever implementation uh, we might have done in native that is not yet started it is still in the phase where it uh, it it brings uh, build system up okay now we can understand it that way so gn once gn is gets compiled this will uh, later on do the compilation of our source code or meta um, uh, meta build uh, upon our source code so it will take some time gn build system is compiled okay here we can see gn generated here okay and we can execute and see gn is working right the, for this session we'll only um, use this build system generated build system to 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 uh, compile an example source code so here is example simple build so we had rust example as well as simple build which is c++ uh, example so we are compiling your c++ example here so for that what we have done uh, we are using gn since i have not set up uh, build script path i am using complete path of gn 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 out default okay so once this is done uh, we will get dot ninja files so and gn has done its job now the comes responsibility comes to ninja
we can see build.gn so those actually uh, got generated in the form of build.ninja and some meta a meta information here okay so object is also in hello.ninja form this is not a binary this is not executable so we have to use now uh, ninja build system okay we uh, before that we can just experiment with few things we can check few arguments what all arguments are set here so the host cpu is x64 and uh, host os is linux so this uh, informations are there we can check we can check few uh, options here with general system now um, we'll do something yeah, so use same uh, output file and use ninja hyphen c to compile in executable so we got generate hello generated here so ninja i've already installed in my machine uh, that's the reason i can directly execute ninja commands here so uh, ninja hyphen c generated hello here if we execute this hello So we can see the size of this hello uh, file also. So this is uh, only 8 KB. That means it is not standalone. It depends on certain libraries. Otherwise, uh, it, 8 KB is not enough for it to execute as standalone. We can see in file hello also. What all? So it depends on certain libraries here. Okay. Since this is very simple hello example not not a lot of independencies and uh, we executed this and we got hello printed 